My name is Emmanuel. I'm three. I go to school. Mommy comes too. This is my little sister, Heaven. She is too. Priscilla is my teacher. We count. My name is Dana. I'm six years old. I'm in grade one. This is my best friend, Marissa. We do everything together. Before kindergarten, I came to this parent center with my nanny. Last year, I was in kindergarten. These are my friends from full day kindergarten. They really miss me. This is my grade one class. I never want to miss a day. I come here a lot with my school. This is where I was baptized. My mom and dad got married in this church. My cousin made her first communion here. I learn about God. I know not about Jesus. My name is Cecilia. I am 10 years old and I am in grade five. My friends are important. I like working with them in my class. best by being quiet and listening. I can be who I am. I don't have to try to be anyone else. I like being upstairs because it's my first time, so I can get used to it. So for the rest of the years I'm here, I can be with everyone else. I'm a part of the group. Amen. 
my school makes me feel welcome. My name is Justin, I am 10 years old, and I'm in grade five. I am a PALS leader. PALS stands for Playground Activity Leaders in Schools. My friends and I wear these red pennies so that we are visible to all students. We make posters and display them on our PALS bulletin board to get students to understand what PALS means. We teach and play organized games with younger students at recess. PALS includes all students who want to play and have fun. We, the leaders, want to help prevent bullying. Sometimes we help kids who are shy and alone. When we see a problem at recess, we step in and try to solve it. We encourage kids to get active and try new games. Being a PALS leader makes me feel responsible and helping people makes me feel great. I'm looking forward to using the leadership skills from PALS in later grades. Thanks to PALS, I feel like I understand the virtues a lot better now. My name is Megan. I'm 14 years old. I'm in grade 9. Last year in grade 8 was so different. The more I thought about high school, the more nervous I got. The first time the counselor came to our class, I was really worried. I had no idea what I was going to take or what high school would be like. If you do not get 50%, particularly in the compulsory course, particularly in a compulsory course, when I imagined being in high school, I just wanted to stay in grade eight forever. When I arrived at my new school, everyone was so welcoming. The link crew were there to reassure me and answer any of my questions. I made lots of new friends, and I love my classes. Drama is my favorite class. It has really helped me build my confidence. I'm even planning to try out for soccer in the spring. Today, I'm really looking forward to the next four years. My name is Justin. I'm 17. I guess I'm the bad kid. When I was younger, I used to like school. Today, not so much. Not because I couldn't do it, but life sort of got in the way. For a while, getting high with my friends seemed like a much better idea than going to math class. I got into a lot of trouble and I guess my dad had enough. He kicked me out. I stayed with some friends, but that didn't last long. I ended up on the street for six weeks. Being homeless and attending school is, well, it's impossible. I was alone. Nobody cared. The truth is, people did care. And the crazy thing is, is that they were at my school. They helped me get back in my house and back in class. It was like they welcomed me home. I sat down with a counselor and she helped me focus on where I was headed. They got me in a credit rescue program for the courses I was in and a credit recovery for the one I was missing. 
I've always been interested in cars, so they got me hooked up in a co-op at a garage. My name is Justin, and I guess I'm not so bad after all. <laughs>